buddy. Hands. Stick your hands out. Do it now. Drop knife. Drop, Drop knife. knife. Come out. Come out of the ground. Crawl on your knees. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Keep your hands out where I can see them. How many body hunters do I have in here? You guys been body hunting before? I know you have. Okay, you guys know you're going to be looking at attics and under houses and things yeah. like that. One of the things that I've always used is a mirror. You know, attack mirror. Well, I got a new product we're going to be adding on the Bell Speak store. We're on a break right now, by the way. Um, be adding on the Bell Speak store, and I'm, I've been kind of tweaking around a little bit, kind of modifying it. And this is what we're going to be adding. It's not even on the store yet. It's got a um, a telescopic. Hold on one second. There it is. Te telescopic. And what this is for is to be able to look into attics, to be able to look underneath. It also has a tack light on it so that if you are looking and it all adjusts, you're looking around a corner, you can actually shine that light where you want it to go. Also, if I get this to work right, there we go, got the strobe. And if you guys aren't familiar with these strobes, they disorientate people. Now, what I did with this one is it also, ha uh, this one also has a hook. Okay, this, uh, you will run into situations where you need to open a door and you can actually hook a door and open it or move things out of the way. Again, the light, but what I did was we always carry these particular cameras. And what I did was I wonder if I can mount that camera onto this so that what this sees, the camera sees. And this is a this is an extreme sports camera, very durable. You could drop it off a motorcycle, it'll go tumbling down the freeway and still work. The glass is replaceable, but here's what's really cool. This lens right here rotates. So you can actually frame your shot. And when you turn it on, you can see it here. But here's where it gets really interesting. There's an app for the drift camera. So let's say, um, Jake, you back there, you have uh, the app on your camera, and I'm over here. Whatever I'm looking at, you can see on your cell phone. There's about a two or three second delay in some cases, depending on what kind of network you're in. But you can see what, what the camera sees, plus it's recording. And if you have not been keeping up on current events, is it important to record what you're out there doing yeah. to protect yourselves? Now, one of the things that you gotta watch out for with the body cams is this. If you have a body cam and it's attached right here, and something happens, it's going to be out of context. You have to have somebody over there getting an overview of the entire shot. But for this stuff right here, if you're carrying a gun, if you're out there bounty hunting, you're doing any of that stuff, you better protect yourselves in case you have not been keeping up with current events. Anybody here know what a blow-off kit is? Blow-off kit, they're also called IFAX. IFAX. Yeah, if you carry a gun and you're not carrying a blow-off kit, that is a problem. That's a big problem. So. Um, Take a look. I don't want you guys getting hurt. And we are running the situations where the new guys are being told, look in the attic, see if he's in there. What do you have to do if you don't have a mirror? You got to stick your head up in there. Yeah. And, and the other thing, too, is if you're not wearing a Kevlar helmet, at the very least, uh, your, your chance of survival will weed out if somebody up there has got bad intentions. And by the way, this isn't the one I use because that one got full of mouth shit. But I used one of these to spot the guy in the attic with all the mouse shit stuff that I stepped in. So that's what that was about. You guys with me on that? I just wanted to bring this up and these are things for you to consider as we start to move into bounty hunting. Cracking? Alright, let's do back let's get in bounty hunting. Yeah. You know what? I like the play. No dick a dick. No dick. Play on play at. Right.